Alright, hey guys, welcome to another video on Legend of Zelda Breath of the Wild. This, the final episode in the three-part series on how to get the full Barbarian set. In this video, I'm going to be showing you how to get the Barbarian Helm. And this one, quite possibly, is the easiest maze to get to because all you literally have to do is what you saw there is teleport to the Akela Tech Lab. Now, this one is the most heavily guarded because there are this place is literally crawling with Guardians. So if you're going to go there, put on all of your Guardian fighting equipment and be prepared for a fight however when I did go through this uh this this maze I only actually fought two guardians there are only two that I actually had to fight and you can see the shrine off in the distance there I'm only had to fight two guardians the rest I actually had to hunt down the ones that are in the air flying I guess they're there to dissuade you from you know going on the top of this thing but you really don't have to worry about them too much. If you stay away from their, their sensor net, then you'll be fine. I actually, it took me a little bit to, to hunt them down to fight them. Okay, so this, like all the other uh, labyrinth mazes, I'm going to shut up and let you see what I do. However, I will tell you that you don't have to worry about two guardians on the ground. That's it. Just two of them on the ground, the rest of them up in the air, and those really don't have to worry about. I'm going to take you through the ground because going through the top would have proven a little bit too treacherous. Blue, yeah, I got him. Proven a little bit too treacherous because it's raining, and trying to get up there during the rain is just ridiculous. Can I say that it rains a lot in this game? All right, so that's it for me for right now. I'll let you watch and see where I go. Oh yeah, um, there's a spot where I'm gonna get a a fire sword, so be on the lookout for that. And I I guess just just watch, man. Alright, if you're wondering, I got kind of confused right here, so I went back to the beginning and I'm going to start over. Well, at least we got that giant core, so let's start over again. And no, I'm not trying to climb up this thing.
Jesus. All right, and this is it. We've made it to the shrine. I want to apologize if this was a little bit difficult. I got kind of confused because I was trying to go for the flame sword. I want that flame giant sword. I'm a sword connoisseur this game, so I had to get the sword. But if you're able to follow along, I'm so happy. And again, I just apologize for it being a little bit difficult. Um, but yeah, this is it. This is the shrine. And you get here, you're going to get the uh, barbarian helm, and that's going to complete the barbarian set. Okay, now to enhance this set of armor, like I told you in the uh, episode number two of this, you're going to have to fight a lot of Lynels. Now to enhance it to the first level, you're going to need three Lynel horns, and that's going to be times three. So you need three for the helm, three for the chest, and then three for the leg wraps. Now to get it to level two, you're going to need five Lynel horns, and then five Lynel hoofs, and you're going to need that times three, so that's going to be 15 Lynel horns, and then 15 Lynel, Lynel hoofs. Now, to get to the third level, you're going to need eight Lionel hoofs and uh, one Lionel guts. And you're going to need that times three for each set of armor, or each, yeah, each piece of armor, rather. And then to enhance to the fourth level, you're going to need Lionel guts times ten. And then one shard of Dinral's horn, and that's it. Oh, wait, no, I take that back. You're going to need a shard of Dinral's horn for the head. You're going to need a shard of Farash's horn for the chest. And then a shard of Nadra's horn for the legs. So that's going to be, uh, for the enhanced times four, you're going to need Lionel Guts times ten, shard of Dinral's horn for the head. To enhance the chest times four, you're going to need Lionel Guts times ten, a shard of Farash's horn times one. And then for the legs, you're going to need Lionel Guts times ten, Shard of Nader, Nadra's Horn times one. So it looks like you're going to have to do a lot of fighting with Lynels to enhance this armor. Um, and you're going to be able to uh, add an effect, attack up, and the set bonus, you get a charge attack and stamina up. So I guess uh, the charge attack gets stronger and your stamina goes up a little bit more while you're using this armor. Okay, so that's it. Thank you so very much for watching. If there's anything else that you would like to see me to do a tutorial on or a how-to or just to show you, put that down in the comments below and I will do my absolute very best to put that on there if it's within my ability. I want to give you a very special thanks for choosing to watch this information on my channel because it really does help my channel grow. So thank you guys. And until next time, I will see you later. Peace out. Gosh, gotta fight a lot of Lionels and those things are tough.